What happens when a team of disciples takes the mission of the gospel seriously? It's like a drop falling into a body of water. That drop creates ripples that can become waves of change. For the last four years, the Fruitful Congregation journey has created ripples of change that are beginning to form a God-sized wave in the Indiana Conference of the United Methodist Church. Probably one of the biggest challenges of the Fruitful Congregation journey for us as a church was getting started and knowing that we were going to have the confidence to make changes in our church. The church here in Madison is an older church and that's both in the age of the building and the historical aspect but also in our congregation and although we had younger people involved in the church we weren't sure how we would get them more involved and how we would really start building that next generation of the church basically my generation and down and we recognized that we were going to need to do more things including adding a new worship service and changing our style of worship but we also knew we didn't want to get rid of what we were already doing because we had a lot of people in our church regularly that loved the worship service we had and what the fruitful congregation journey allowed us to do was to come together come together as a group and focus on the changes we need to make, the, the adjustments we need to make, but also give us the tools we needed to, to really get started with a new worship. When I came to Madison Trinity, they were already in year two of the Fruitful Congregational Journey, so the thing I especially focused on was how important the workshops would be to uh, help us get started. I wouldn't have to uh, put those workshops together myself. They would already be provided for us, and that greatly enhanced our ability to jumpstart things and get things moving very quickly. And the fruitful congregation journey has brought us to where we move quickly when things need to happen. When changes need to happen, it's really quick. And it also has brought a life into this church that really was fading quickly before we really started that, that renaissance in our church a few years ago. Trinity has always been a outgoing church as far as our members being outgoing people. We've always been very welcome, but with the with the tools we gained from the Fruitful Congregation journey, we changed our focus in a way that now not only are we welcoming in our church, we're welcoming outside of our church. We have gone from a church where we were thrilled when people would come visit us to a church that's bringing people in to come visit us. We've really seen that life in our church, in the community, and we've gone from what was always known as the church that everybody used to always go to, to the church that people are talking about. And we think that's important not only for Trinity United Methodist here in Madison, but for God's church universally, whether that's here in Madison or whether that's across the state of Indiana or in the whole world. We think that, that, that feeling God's call to reach out and serve our community is really what's going to make the church grow.